Alright guys, what's going on? This is the Buck Commander, and uh, today we have a gameplay on Summit Team Deathmatch in Black Ops 1 using a 7 silencer. I think I go 24 and 2 in this gameplay, but you know, realistically I go 24 and 1 because one of my deaths, uh, actually both of my deaths are really stupid. Uh, one of my deaths, so it's self-inflicted, I end up jumping off the edge, and I was trying to be like a sneaky giraffe and stuff, and like, jump up, jump up, jump up, do a bunch of jump spots like Team Martin showed me, <laughs> and then uh, I ended up falling off the edge, so I might have to sue Team Martin about that one, I don't know, we'll, we'll have to see what goes on, um, but anyway, so, uh, blah, 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 blah. what should I talk about in this commentary, you know, I really don't have a whole, I don't have a topic because this gameplay is kind of rather short, it's not insanely long, and, you know, I guess we could talk about my absence on PlayStation, on YouTube, so, uh, recently, recently in the past week or so after I've done that video I really have not played much because I, I just don't feel like it you know I really do not feel like playing uh, I'll get on PS3 because I'm bored and then I'll go on Netflix because I'm bored but then I don't even watch a movie I just sit there and kind of scroll through the movies I'm like do I want to watch this one do I not want to watch no, 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 no. you know I, it's, I do that back and forth now Recently, though, I have watched the Sniper Reloaded, or I think it's, it might be Sniper Reloaded. It's Sniper Reloaded, or it's the Sniper, you know, something like that. If you guys type in Sniper on, on Netflix, it should be the first one that pops up. That is a good movie, I swear that. I mean, the Sniper, I'm just gonna call it Sniper. Uh, the Sniper is a great, great movie. Um, and I'll talk about that later. And my, the next one I watched was a Memorial Day. Now, my brother's like, dude, watch Memorial Day. I'm like, uh, I'm like yo, what? Yeah, hold on. God. I will take my... <laughs> Alright, anyway. I have to take my pills, apparently. And that, I mean, I've, yeah, I've been sick for, like, I don't know, this, this whole year. I'm not gonna lie, I've been sick since January 1st or something like that. Maybe even December 30th or something. I've been sick for a while, and I don't know if I told you guys, but I have, like, an ear infection. And I thought I was too old for ear infections. Apparently not. Apparently you still get ear infections. Uh, and that, that's kind of weird. Because I, I always thought they were like for six-year-olds who go swimming a lot. And it's like the middle of winter. I really haven't gone swimming. I'm also not six. So I was kind of surprised when I had an ear infection. But I think money goes anyway. So thanks for reminding me. Um, Alright, back to what I was talking about. So Memorial Day, it's like... It, it, Memorial Day, if you type it in. I, mean, I think it's rated 4.7... 3 fourths of a star. Uh, it's, it's really, really good. It really is. Um, and it's like... I don't know, do I want to explain it or do you guys want to watch it yourself? That's question. Considering some of you guys might watch it, some of you guys might not watch it. No. It's basically a movie where this kid, he's like 13, it's oh, it, it's like the perfect balance of serious funniness, if that makes any sense. Uh, it, it really is, it's awesome. Th this kid finds like his footlocker of his grandpa during World War II and he's like, alright, if you pick this out I'll tell a story about it, it's like a flashback here, there, that, blah, blah. Uh, and this is where I jump off that. I'm like, no! Darn it! And then I'm like, no! Oh, come on! I, I thought I was actually going for dogs, but I forgot I had UAV for whatever reason. Um, but he goes to his footlocker, he tells him stories, and the last one and the other ones are, they're, I mean, they're good stories. It really, it really is a good movie. So you guys watch Memorial Day, and I'm not gonna wreck it for you guys anymore. <clears throat> and the second one I was telling you, or the first one I was actually telling you about was The Sniper. Um, it's basically, it's actually, I don't think it. Eh, I, I, I didn't catch it in the beginning that it was based on a true story, but I have the feeling that it has been, or you know, was was actually based on a true story. It, it's actually like a 2010 movie. Memorial Day is really recent, it's like 2012, and I'd be. I don't know how many awards it's won already, but if it has it, it's definitely gonna get some in the near future. But <coughs> oh my goodness, um. But the sniper's basically where he goes into an African village because it's like, you know, I guess it's peacekeeping or he's trying to do something in, the, in Congo, which is, you know, in Africa. And his, his, and when I say his, I'm talking about the guy who's in the main story, you know. Uh, so his guys get basically, get, and he's a nice one, by the way. His guys get depleted, he has to figure out what's going on. And so, we, yep, guys, I will see you later. Watch Memorial Day, watch the sniper. Epic final kill again, epic drop shot, epic commentary. I'll see you guys later. Have a good day.